We continue our Advent devotional themes with Advent Conspiracy. This week our theme is to worship fully. And I love this story of the Magnificat from Luke chapter 1, verses 39 through 56. I'm not going to read the whole thing, but this is after Mary visits Elizabeth. Mary has found out that she is going to be giving birth to the Messiah, and she responds with, My soul glorifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has been mindful of the humble state of his servant. From now on, all generations will call me blessed, for the Mighty One has done great things for me. Holy is his name. I'm going to stop there. The reading continues. It's a beautiful song. I'm not going to sing it for you. But the reason I love this for our theme, Worship Fully, is Mary has just found out she, an unwed young woman, is going to be giving birth to Jesus the Messiah. These are not the best circumstances, even by today's standards, let alone first century standards. And yet Mary, in the midst of such a difficult circumstance, worships God. And I think it's important to reflect this season especially on. It's pretty easy sometimes to worship God when everything's going just the way we would want, and life is good, and everything's perfectly in place. And yet we look to Mary, a young woman who worships God even when things aren't going perfectly. So as we reflect this Advent season, can you, like Mary and so many others from our Bible stories, worship God even in the midst of difficult circumstances?